Good morning, everybody. Another beautiful day here in the fabul fabulous desert. It's moving day and dump day. That's right. We're going to go up here. We're in line. Hang on. Hope nobody gets sick. We're in line to go up here and dump. So there's two stations here. So it goes pretty fast. We're about fourth in line. And uh, once you dump up here, um, you pull ahead a little bit farther, then there's a fresh water station up there. Yep. So, I don't know, we were here 10 days? Yeah. And we just hit E on the water. Right. We got plenty of black tank, plenty of gray tank left, but uh, we were running out of water. But I took one long shower, uh, hot shower this morning I on empty. <laughs> So, I mean, we could have probably got three more, four more sailor showers out of that because I ran the water a long time just to see if I could hit empty, but it never did. No. So anyway, Princess P, she's ready to go. Bentley, you ready to go, Bentley? So, yep. Where, where is it that we're going now, then? I don't know exactly. Where is, is it, was it Pomosa? I don't know. I don't know. We're just following the, the tribe. Yeah. <laughs> and we're gonna just, we gotta go up there and get a permit, so uh, yeah, we'll just follow them we've up. We've already paid for the hundred and eighty dollars for the six months of whatever here. We're gonna go and spend some time with them. Yeah, we're at Papa Drew's. Was it? Yeah, Papa? Papa Drew is having a get together, and the Phoenix, um, not the Phoenix, the, the Nomadic Rambler. Ramblers invited us to come with them, so we're gonna go. Yep, yeah, go meet some new people. Go to a new BLM that we've never been before. So yeah. that's what we're trying to do is just find different places out here. So. If, if see we come really back works. next year, we, we know where to go, see how everything works. But anyway, we'll show you uh, on the way out where the gate is, where you, what you got to do on the entrance in here. And I may even get out and film it real quick. So uh, we'll see how it goes and who's, who's in front of us or who's behind us. So we want to kind of stay up with the group so we don't get lost. But anyway, hey, some days here. That's right. We'll touch base with you in a little while. Stop the madness. Start the adventure. All right. Well, well we, what we do, Kim? We went and dumped and got water, and now we're on to our new destination. We have the Nomadic Ramblers in front of us. We're following Bobby and Sharon, and it's only about 15 minutes away where we're going. So we're going to go get us a 14-day permit and find a place to park, and we'll show you where we are. But we want to show you around here since this is the most south. Yeah, this is. Not the farthest one out, but this is the one past La Posa North and La Posa West. It's getting crowded out here, but there's still lots of room. Yeah, you can you can find some place if you wanted to go out here by yourself. But La Posa North, and we'll try to show you if I remember why we're going by if it doesn't get too hectic. Uh, and La Posa uh, West is getting kind of crowded, especially because the big tents fixing to open up here. I think. Uh, or four days maybe this weekend i can't remember yeah. my day so anyway the uh i'll show you the gate when we get up there what you have to do uh, up here at uh, la posa south all right we are getting up here to the main gate so when you come in off 95 uh, south it's approximately mile marker 100 somewhere around in there you want to turn east or left if you're coming from quartzite and you'll come up to this little building right here. You'll pull in past the building and you'll park right over here in this parking lot. And then you'll go in and pay either your $40 for 14 days or $180 for uh, six months or whatever it is, September 15th to whatever. But you just gotta remember, you gotta have the exact change or a check. So make sure you have that. If you don't have a checking account or don't want to give them a check, you got to have exactly $180. They do not make change. You deposit the money in the little uh, uh, vault yourself so they don't have to touch the money. But there's 95 right up here. So we're gonna get up on down the road, go have another adventure. All right, we are coming up on the Posa North and the Posa West. This is right when you get to the court site sign on the south side of town. Over to the right is La Posa North. Elevation 879. 
and as you can see over on the left, the Posa West. And that's a lot of people that's came in since we've been here. Yep. So as you can see, they're parking up by the big tent up there. There's more and more people over there because they can just walk in the big tent and all the other vendors up there. Works out pretty handy. So this is the fun time. January, middle of January, towards the end of January when everybody shows up. Yeah, there's a bunch of people. But that's all right. You meet some great people out here. So far, we've had a blast. So we're, we're coming into the Kewen intersection where you'll turn left to go down to a lot of the vendors. And you can turn right and go over there to the vendors also. If you turn right, right here, you can also get you some firewood on the right. That's a big for show. three little boxes for yep. $30. Yep. <laughs> it's not cheap. Do not give wood away here. So I don't know where they can truck it in from, but they do. But you can see right over there is where you'll get wood. They got good food. Every time we go over there, it smells good. Yeah, Bobby was saying you can get a dollar hamburger in the afternoon after a certain time. Yep. Yeah. And if you turn left there, then you'll go down to all the greatness. Yep. Now we're fixing to go over I-10. Remember, there is no exit for 95 here. You have to either go to exit 19 or exit 17. Well, there's old I-10 going towards California, where you can pay a dollar more a gallon for gas. Good not the truth. And actually, when we went to the loves to get gas the other day it was 324 but we had our logistics card and we actually got it for 270 274 was 274 it? okay i thought it was 274 but it sounded yeah so loves so is a ticket saved, with our fuel card we have saved a good bit yeah when you give from 274 to 329 i mean that's a good that's a good little jump yep it's well worth it yeah it is all right, let me put this down and concentrate. I don't want to be that guy that did that thing, so. <laughs> we'll catch you when we get up here farther, when we check in and uh, get a permit.